What's up guys, Graham here, playing the Marksman Rogue, and I haven't played Marksman in a long time, so hopefully I'm not too rusty at it, uh, yeah, I'm kind of, kind of nervous how I'm going to perform with this, because I haven't played Marksman in a while, I know Marksman, playing Marksman is very easy, and has the potential to kill lots of people, even without real skilled gameplay so I think I'll do alright but never know man it's easy to forget your buttons forget to use certain abilities and stuff whenever you haven't used it in a while because I'm the type that I play so many different specs and experiment and just it's hard to remember all my buttons all the time or my abilities so uh Okay, we've got a healer targeted here. Uh, throw some arrows. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. No. Not cool. Not cool, man. Eradicate you for that effort. Pull me in, I'll debuff you. Alright, let's try to pick off some of these lesser HP targets instead of the tanky warrior there. Because he's obviously running right in the ish and trying to take a lot of damage. So, if that's his goal, that's probably not what we're wanting to give him. Alright. Whoa, 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 taking a lot of damage. Ah! No! No! Man, I went down really fast there. Wonder what hit me. Let's see here. Uh, I'm not seeing anything hit me real hard. It's more like accumulation of a lot of people hitting me. Got pulled in and got targeted by way too many people at once. Yeah. Nothing hit me particularly hard, so it was just accumulation of a lot of damage. Let's get buffed up and get back in the action. Yeah, and that's that's what gets me is a lot of people say to uh, instead of going a little bit into Rift Stalker like my build does, they they say to go into assassin and stuff to get more DPS because you're on the outer range. You're not supposed to be taking damage anyway. Well, look what just happened. You know, once you get pulled in, once you get uh, opened up by assassin or something like that, if you're just going to insta die, then you know, good luck being a PVPer that can't take a hit ever. Basically, you don't need to be really tanky, but you need to be tanky enough to where you can survive uh, like a rogue starting to open up on you or getting pulled in or something to where you at least can retaliate and try to do your leap backs, uh, port away or something. Right then, I just had too many people hitting me, but normally whenever I get pulled in and it's just three maybe four people over there you know i have enough time to get away but that was just way too much damage i couldn't take all that all right so i guess we're going to farm them at their spawn not bad wow he just jumped right down into our whole group i don't know what he's thinking I guess he thought people were going to follow him. <laughs> and they said the hell with that. They just sat up there on the ledge. Are they going to jump down? Anybody going to jump down? Anybody? Oh, somebody jumped down. Let, let's keep it at max range. Let, let's see if we can kill him at max range. Let's not give him enough leeway to target me. But we're going to be just close enough to target him. 
Because marksman range is like 35 meters. Nice. Yeah, he dotted me up some there, but as for his normal spells, I don't think he could reach me. <laughs> I'm just wanting to toy with this guy right now. All right, seems like we're running away with this one. Dang, we got him four cap now. Oh, there goes that guy I was picking on just earlier. Oh, he's going to do the ring around the rosy stuff here. I like to play games, man. I'll chase you. Let's have a game. Oh, you're hitting me in the back while I was hitting the other person, huh? Uh oh. Getting a little low in health. Can't be sticking around for that stuff. Get my drink on. Let's get our drink on. Yeah, whenever I'm fighting, I like to booze it up in between rounds. Sit down, have me some uh, Torvin Stout. Alright. Well... We've kind of got this hand in hand here. I guess I can go farm them at their spawn or something, but. Hmm. Oh, there goes a victim. Hello, victim. Nice to meet you. My name is Grim. And I like to shoot people with arrows. I'm sorry this had to happen to you, but unfortunately, oh, the healer arrived one second too late, but now I'm taking on a healer and a warrior, so I don't know if I like this. I don't know if I like this. Let's pin him down so he isn't charging me the entire time, and let's get the heck out of there. Nice. God healed. God heals, bro. I was wanting to see what kind of damage I was going to be doing to that healer and warrior before I got out of there, but yeah. It wasn't enough to where I was going to survive that fight, probably. So, I CC'd down the warrior and I got out of there. That's another good thing about Rift Stalker is it's got the the shadow shift allows you to port away. Very good for getting away. So not only do you have a little bit in, increased uh, tankiness, but you also can get away easier whenever you're in bad situations. They got us three cap now, but all we need is one to win this match. Bam, there you go. Sit down, son. <laughs> These guys with the evil jester's mask. All right, how'd we do here? We went 11 and 1. Ah, oh, look, Chevik, my guildy went 9 and 0. Told you he was a good mage. Yep, yeah, and neither of us got much healing at all. We just went around killing people and rarely ever got healed.